Okay. Oh man, it's like the fourth video I did today, man. Jesus Christ. All right, y'all. Listen, let me let me let me see if I can pull up this this uh this message real quick. I had somebody hit me up, and she was um where is it? Ah, oh, did I delete it? Please don't tell me I deleted it. Uh, I think I deleted it already. That's cool. Whatever. Um. Whatever. All right. That's that's cool. Usually when people hit me up and they ask me these questions, man, I always make sure I delete the messages and stuff like that because I just need everybody to know that like once you hit me up and you reach out to me, all that stuff is going to remain confidential. You ain't got to worry about me screenshotting or try to post or, or try to expose people. I don't have time for stuff like that, man. I done been through it all. You, I'm, a, I'm, I'm assuming that you've been through it all also. So everybody's going to be reaching out to me and asking for some type of advice. It's obviously either desperate or curious. You know what I'm saying? But it is what it is, man. It's, it's cool. I, I, I deleted the message already, man. That's cool. Basically, this lady hit me up and was asking me about some guy that she's, that she's really interested in. She said, she said she's, quote, unquote, really, really feeling. That's what she said. I'm really, really feeling him. And so, basically, she wants to know what my thoughts is on, on men that's sleeping with other women while they're still in the talking stage with another girl. So basically, she's been talking to this guy. They're not official. They're just talking. They went on a couple of days. She said they haven't been sexually active yet. Cool. I'll take her word for it. Uh, she was basically saying that they haven't been sexually active yet, but she saw like hickeys on his neck and she confronted him about it. And he, he basically like told her the truth. Like, hey, yo, well, I was sleeping with a girl two days ago. You know, and so she's like, yo, we've, we've been talking for like a month now. So I'm trying to see what's up. She's like, what, what, what are my thoughts on it? Do I think it's okay? Do you, do I think she's over, do, do I think she's overreacting? And so I said, all right, cool. You know, I responded to her already. I can't read to y'all verbatim what I said, but I basically said something along the lines of this. Ladies, listen, I, I get it. I get it, ladies. When you get a guy that you're really, really feeling, when you get a guy that you really, really like, I get it. I understand. You only want, you, let me make sure this light, this, this light, right. I, I, I get it. I understand, ladies. You want to make sure that uh, whatever guy that you the, the guy that you like is the guy that's going to be taking you serious, man, and all that good stuff. But I can tell y'all right now, a lot of men, if he's anything like me or have my type of mindset or my type of thoughts, if we're not officially together, I'm still smashing all these damn whatever girl I want to smash. And that's facts. A lot of guys is going to have that type of mindset. Hell, some guys have that mindset to where even if you are together, they still going to be sleeping with them. You know what I'm saying? I'm not a part of that community, but you know, if I'm single and I'm talking and we're in a talking stage, I'm still sleeping with whoever the hell I want to sleep with. Even if we are sleeping together, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> until we become officially official, until we sit down and be like, hey, yo, you know, I'm, I'm your man, you my girl, blah, 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 blah. Until that day happens, I'm going to continue to sleep with as many women as I want to sleep with. And that's just facts. I told y'all this all the time. When I'm in a relationship, you're the only person I'm sleeping with. When I'm single, I sleep with who the hell I want to sleep I don't got to answer nobody. Don't ask me about why I got hickeys on my neck and all this, that, and third. Stuff like that. Would have, I told her, I said, if you would say that to me and we were just having, and we were just talking or we were just having sex, nine times out of ten, if I didn't have any type of feelings for you, I would have just blocked you and kept it moving. You know, but shout out to him, man. I told her, I said, yo, he kept it real. He could have lied and be like, oh, well, I had an allergic reaction or I had whatever, whatever. You know, whatever excuse that he could have thought of, man. But, you know, I, I just need ladies again. I just need y'all to understand. A lot of guys is going to have this type of mindset. I didn't say all guys. I didn't say every single guy. That's not what I'm saying. A lot of guys is going to have this type of mindset. If we're not officially together, we're just quote unquote talking, going out, you know what I'm saying? To a couple dinner dates or, 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 you know, getting coffee or whatever. I don't know. Just, just doing like random things until you become he or she, or both of you agree to become official. He can do whatever the hell he want to damn do. Like, well, like why, why are you worried about what he damn doing? If that's the case, tell him straight up, hey, hey yo, listen, like we're talking, but I want this to end up as, as something serious, and I just need to know that you're not sleeping with, we're not sexually active with anyone. I get it from both sides of the spectrum. I get it from his side. That's his side. Now her side. You're seriously thinking about being in a committed relationship with him. Maybe you're going to have sex, maybe not, who knows, whatever. You're seriously thinking about being in a committed relationship with him. You don't want any other girl touching him, kissing him, uh, you know, pleasing him sexually or whatever, just pleasing him in general. You don't want any of that. I get it. I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm not saying you're right. I see it from both sides of the spectrum. I see it from both angles, both sides. I understand. But again, he's more so in the right because he's still single. You're more so in the wrong because y'all aren't officially together. So let's, let's do it this way. I'm talking to a girl and, you know, we're both in the talking stages. 
I, I see, I look on her phone that she's texting another guy that, you know, they had fun last night or whatever or whatever. And then I get upset and I question her about it. And I say, hey, yo, well, what's up with this guy? Well, you know, I thought me and you was talking. And then she'll look at me and she'll be like, hey, yo, well, like, what, well, we ain't together. Like, what the hell? Like, we not officially, we just talking. Like, what the hell? She's going to look at me and be like, man, if you don't get your ass up out of here, man, get the hell. Like, no. And rightfully so. Again, like I said, whether she's right, whether she's wrong, that's, you know, that's, that's, neither, that's neither here nor there. The point of the matter is y'all are not officially together. So you have no right or no say so in what he or she is damn doing when y'all aren't together or when y'all aren't, you know what I'm saying, face to face or whatever. Ladies, I, I, a lot of y'all want this, this, <laughs> a lot of y'all want this, this, uh, do as I say, not as I do type of thing because i asked her i was like yo well are you talking to anyone are you have you been dating other and she's like oh yeah but i'm not sleeping with them i'm like okay but he can be mad about that like why are you on some oh do as i say not as i do type of thing y'all want to have a lot of women not all women a lot of y'all ladies want to have all these string of guys bro and i'm telling y'all majority of the friends that i have are females majority of my friends are female friends and they put me on game about a lot about the things that a lot of women and also I read a lot but they put me on game about a lot of things that a lot of women do okay a lot of y'all be having all these damn guys saving y'all phone the guy that gives y'all money the guy that, that that gives you a ride the guy that gives off the good dick the, the weed guy the liquor guy you got the other guy that that that, that bring that that pays your bills your phone bills your car note your your transportation your this that the other guy that lives out of state that flies you out every, every other month like bro the man this man got one guy that one girl that he's sleeping with and, and you want to shame him trying to make it seem like you're not talking to nobody that's why that's the main reason why I asked her that question. Like, yo, are you talking to anybody? Oh, yeah, but I'm not sleeping with them. She probably is telling the truth, but nine times out of ten, it's probably cap. <laughs> I'm telling you right now, it's probably cap. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man. So that that's my that's my response on that. Ladies, I I, I need y'all to understand, man. Some of y'all understand, but some of y'all just want to do this on purpose. It's all good. But y'all, y'all gotta chill out with this. Y'all got to chill out with this. Y'all cannot control every single narrative. You're not going to be able to control every person. You're not going to be able to make every single guy do what you want them to do. The, real, the guy that you really want, like I'm assuming this is the guy that she really want. He he has that type of abundance to where he has different varieties and different options of different females that's hitting him up. And so that's why he's able to sleep with whatever other girl that he's damn sleeping with. So now that you know all this, and again, like I said, me and her, we spoke, we already came to a conclusion of what she's going to do. Um, now, now that you know all this, lady, you have two ladies. You have two options. It's either you're gonna be quiet and do the same thing, sleep with other guys, or keep dating like she's doing. She's still dating. Keep dating other guys until y'all officially become together, and then you can cut the guys off. Or you can be like, "Hey, yo, you know what? This isn't for me. You know, um, you know, I wish you the best. Blah blah blah. blah. I gotta keep it moving. And you just take the L and, t and keep it moving. It is what it is, man. That's your only two options that I look at it. Or you can just sleep with him and, and, and be one, another one of his females that he's sleeping with. I have no idea, bro. Y'all, y'all, a lot of y'all make this way more complicated than what it already is. And I'm just going to put it out there, man. A lot of y'all make it way more complicated than what it already is, man. It's really not that serious. All right, cool. He's sleeping with another damn female or, fem or females. Who knows? Um, it's, it's really not that serious, bro. It's really not that serious, man. So I, I just look at y'all and tell y'all this. If you really are feeling him, sit him down and have that type of conversation to the point where you letting, you basically putting all the cards on the table. You let him know what's up. Hey, yo, I'm really feeling you. I really want to stand a third. But you sleeping with the other women. I'm not really feeling that. I can't really deal. I can't really. Communication, ladies. Communication. If he not trying to understand or see where you're coming from, then nine times out of ten, maybe that guy really isn't for you as far as a relationship. Maybe he can just be a, a, a smashing buddy, a guy that you sleep with. Or maybe you just don't want anything to do with him at all. Either or, that's fine. That's your prerogative that's you know that's between you and whoever you pray to and whoever whatever so i don't know man so ladies let me know what y'all thought about this. this 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 video was really really short man straight to the this, this these are the type of videos i like doing straight to the point I, I ain't got i ain't got to sit here and go through all the other nonsense straight to the point man but ladies let me know what y'all think about this y'all what what would you do if you're in a talking stage with a guy and you find out that, you're, that he's sleeping with with another woman how would you feel about that would you feel uh, would you feel some type of way or would you be like hey yo well we ain't together so i can care less let me know what's up fellas man have you ever been in it i've been in something like this man plenty of times i've been in something like this plenty of times where I, um some girl i was talking to she saw me walking another girl on campus to to her car and so she confronted me on some oh who's that girl you walking i'm like 
And I, I got confused. I'm like, this is back when I was doing my bachelor's. I'm confused. I'm like, bro, shit. I mean, last time I checked, I was I was single. But all right, cool. Why are you questioning me about what I'm doing and who I'm doing it with? Anyway, but fellas, like, let, let me let me know what's up, fellas. Man. How, how do y'all feel about that, man? Do y'all, I, I, I've been, again, like I said, I've been in that situation. Have you ever been in that situation? If you have, let me know what what, what, you, what you did, what your mindset was, what your thoughts, what your actions was. Like, let me know what's up, man. Holla at me, man. So, like I said, it was a short video, man. But anyway... Thanks for watching. Please, 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 if you haven't, hit that subscribe button, man. Also, too, hit that bell, sit on the side, so anytime I make an upload, the notification will pop up and alert you. Also, too, make sure y'all hit that like, y'all hit that share. I look forward to reading all y'all comments, if any. So, until next time, y'all be safe for her, cub. Finish line, I ran past it. So egotistic, so cocky, so conceited. Cause I'm better than your average. I'm mad sick when I spit that shit.